Hey guys, what is up? Uh, it's Adam here from Moonlit Productions and today I am going to show you how to create slow motion in Sony Vegas Pro 10. Now this is a beginner's tutorial so um, if you're watching this and you're a pro, obviously uh, take the information in um, but this is for beginners uh, using starting to use Sony Vegas for the first time okay so uh, I'm in Sony Vegas and I've imported my raw footage here I've already color corrected it and um, this is just a video of YouTube of a BMX stunt which I just downloaded and popped into here um, so <coughs> the first thing you want to do is obviously I've started a new composition um, go up to file new and when you press new it will come up with the properties, project properties now what you want to do is see up here you want to switch it and make sure you have it on HD 720 60 frames per second or almost 60 frames anyway so click on that make sure you have uh, the field order on none pixel aspect ratio on one, output rotation zero um, frame rate obviously can change here, but you want it on the highest frame rate, which you f bleh, highest frame rate what you filmed in. So obviously you want to try and film in uh, 60 frames per second. So the next thing you go down to pixel format, and if it's on 8-bit, change it to 32-bit floating range point full range. Uh, Compositor gamma uh, one linear, uh, full resolution rendering quality best. You want that. So the resolution is a lot better when you render it out. Motion type blur, uh, Gaussian, and uh, deinterlace method none because we're not blending anything together. So click OK. Okay, so now once you've got your clip imported, now you want to do slow motion. So I'll just play you what I've got. Okay. So it's just a guy doing a, a 180 or something. I don't know. I'm not very good at BMX stuff. Um, okay. So what you want to do first, try you want to find your in and out points of where um, you want the slow motion to occur. So zoom in your time, your timeline using the scroll wheel, and just click along or scroll, hold, scroll along and find the in and out points. So we want, ooh, let's have the in point around here, and hit S, split the clip, and then find the out point. You want about here, so press S again. So, this clip here in the middle is the clip you want to slow down and keep the rest normal so it goes fast, slow, fast. Okay, we're not working with any audio in this at the moment because um, obviously you don't really need to. Um, it's more advanced, so I'll show you that uh, in a later tutorial. But just for this tutorial, uh, we're just going to slow you. I'm just going to slow. slow Oh god, show you how to slow down the uh, video clip first. Okay, so you've got your uh, split clip which you want to slow down. What you want to do is you want to go to the beginning of the clip, zoom out a bit more, and make sure there's enough space between here and your neck and the out point. What you want to do next, this is how you slow down the clip. You hold control, and when I hold control, you see I hover over the end of the clip and it has this swiggly line. This is the time stretch button. So what you want to do is you want to click and drag. And you want to drag it to whatever uh, is necessary. So I've dragged it to about 25%, let's say. Um, so now, this squiggly line indicates you slowed down the clip. When I play it, going to slow down okay so if you want to slow it down a bit more to keep dragging notice though if you slow it down too much it's going to get a bit blurry well not blurry but juttery so you want to keep it a kind of average rate without um, screwing up pixelation or anything like that so play from the beginning okay so that looks pretty cool like that uh, so actually yeah that would be quite cool slow down this part as well so same method again hold control 
you can do it from the beginning or the end of the clip, it doesn't really matter. And bam. There we go, and just do a fade out here. Nice. So fade in. And all we gotta do. Yeah. There we go. Okay, nice. Right, so that's it guys. Um so when you're done, just loop it to where you want to render it from. Go to file, render as, and render away. Thanks for watching guys, this short tutorial on how to time stretch in Sony Vegas. Peace out. Thank you.